I'd like to welcome the newest addition to Marble Family, the run amok. For something that you want to get outside, get down, get dirty, run amok, this is it. At only 15 foot by 6 foot 6, it'll track in the same wheel track as your four wheel drive. On top of that, we've added 35 inch Mickey Thompson tyres, we've got Alco ventilated disc brakes, we've got Alco Enduro full off road suspension with dual shockies. This is going to go where you want it to go, but it's going to have all the luxuries inside that the wife will be happy to come with you. Now, for starters, we start at the front here. We've got your DO35 fully articulated off-road coupling. You've got a six inch A-frame, 6B2, which runs the whole way back to a four inch razor. You've got your big box on the front, which has got two ger twin jerry can holders, storage one side, generator slide the other, with your Marvel Insignia um, stone deflector on the front here. Plus, you've got a big work light up the front. So the light bar can illuminate the whole area. It is a floodlight. So that way if you're working at night or if you're inside the van in the middle of nowhere and you hear a bit of commotion outside, you can flick it on and light up the place. As we move around now, all off-road vans, whether it be off-road or on-road, most important part of it is the kitchen. Now, we're big believers in you live outside when you're outside, when you're away. So what better way than to bring the kitchen outside as well? So you've got a full hot and cold sink, nice stainless prep area, a hooded barbecue with temperature gauge so you can do the roast. Now it's got your warming rack, your grill tray, and on top of that, your twin burner for the whistling kettle for your cupper in the morning. Obviously it's got bay fitting and there's hot and cold water plumb to this. Light so you can see what you're doing at night. The big thing where a lot of these smaller ones fail is they have their little wind out awning which aren't really great in even the slightest of breeze. We've been able to fit quite a large proper Dometic a and &E rollout awning on it, similar to the bigger brothers and the Marvel family. You've got external storage for all your knives, your plates, your cups, your forks. Uh, external speakers, so you can listen to the radio out here. External TV points, table. So it really is designed to live outside. We've got a very high quality tyre in here with a Mickey Thompson. It's an ATZ P3 31575R16. Now we've got it on a speedy rim with your Alco ventilated disc brakes with our Alco IQ7 assist. Now, to put it all together, we've added the Alco Enduro full outback suspension with twin shockies. This van's designed to get up and go. It'll go wherever you'll pull it. Guys, just because we've got a bit of a tank outside, it doesn't mean that we have to rough it inside. As you hop inside, you've got a, a full-size queen bed. Now, this has got a pillow top and a spring mattress. 95% of the time you're in a van, you're asleep. You've got to be comfortable. As you can see, we use the biggest windows we can. Now, these are all double glazed, um, great for insulation, and they've all obviously got drop-down screens to keep all the bugs out as well. You've got a 24-inch TV, so you can still watch the telev television, uh, the football or the motor racing when you're away. 12-volt Sirocco fan when you're free camping. You've got twin skylight hatches, as well as your scupper vent, or more commonly known as a pressure hatch to try and keep the dust out. Now you're inside, you've got your emergency seating. So if you do hit that bad weather and you've got to sit inside, you can sit in here and have a meal or a game of cards or a board game. Now, where we've taken it to another level in this smaller unit. Now at only 15 foot by six foot six, what we've been able to do is actually fit a complete full en suite in it. Not only have you got a separate shower, separate toilet, separate vanity, you've also got a little two kilo wall mounted washing machine. So you can actually you know, wash your desirables rather than put it in the, the caravan park at six bucks a load. Plus you've got a porcelain bowl toilet which has got generous room either side. So you know, even the bigger blokes you can still get in there and it's user friendly. Now more, more often not people have to rely on carrying second even third fridges with them. Because a lot of your smaller vans have only got a little 90 litre underbench fridge. Well not us guys, 208 litre, ever cool, dual compressor, upside down fridge freezer. So you've got separate compressors for both fridge and freezer. As you see loads of room. And then it goes to another level down here with your freezer, full draw system, and at 208 litres, this is class leading. Now, the shower is more than generous in size. You can actually drop the soap in there and pick it back up. Uh, and you've got loads of drawers, loads of storage, and you've got actually a full-size oven, separate oven, separate grill, full burner stove inside as well. So you've got full cooking facilities outside as well as inside. Guys, if you're looking for something small, narrow, it's going to track behind your four-wheel drive and go anywhere that your vehicle will pull it, 
this is the one for you. We're introducing the Brisbane Show. Come and see us, guys. You won't be disappointed. Thank you.